Every year, Queensland paramedics attend to thousands of trauma patients. Part of our job as a paramedic is the identification and management of patients with serious and life-threatening hemorrhages. The introduction of the new emergency bandage, or Israeli bandage as it is otherwise known, will help our paramedics to better control external hemorrhage in the field. The following is a short collection of videos that will demonstrate to you the appropriate application of these bandages in a number of situations. To dress a neck wound, remove the bandage from the packaging, raise the patient's opposite arm above the head and place the dressing pad over the wound. Now wrap the bandage leader around the body and into the armpit opposite the wound. Insert the bandage through the pressure applicator and pull back to tighten. Continue bandaging around the body through the opposite armpit to keep the bandage away from the trachea. Fasten the closure bar at any convenient point on the bandage and then lower the raised arm to increase pressure on the wound and further distance the bandage from the trachea. Remove the selected bandage from its packaging and place the non-adherent pad over the wound, positioning the wound between the pressure applicator and the label. Wrap the bandage leader around the head. Insert the bandage into the pressure applicator and pull back firmly in the opposite direction to lower the pressure applicator over the wound and continue bandaging. To turn the direction of bandaging, hook the bandage leader behind a corner of the pressure applicator and wrap the bandage under the chin and over the patient's head. Fasten the closure bar at any convenient point on the bandage. Remove bandage from packaging and place the dressing pad over the wound. Wrap the bandage around the limb and insert into the pressure applicator. Now firmly pull back the bandage in the opposite direction and continue bandaging. Fasten the closure bar at any convenient point on the bandage. Now for a severe uncontrolled hemorrhage, additional pressure can be applied. Insert the closure bar between the last one to two bandage layers and rotate to apply focused high pressure over the wound. Now fasten the closure bar at any convenient point on the bandage. 